Hello, welcome to Catch On Channel. If you're new here, I invite you to subscribe to our channel and turn on notifications to be informed whenever a new video is released. Today, we're going to talk about a major winter storm that hit the northern plains and upper midwest of the United States on Wednesday with strong winds and heavy snow. This forced hundreds of schools to close, cancelled flights, and made it difficult, if not impossible, to travel by car in some areas of the country. Over 50 million Americans were under a winter weather alert on Wednesday morning as the storm moved across a wide swath of the western and northern United States, heading east. The National Weather Service said that up to 24 inches of snow and winds of up to 60 miles per hour were expected in some locations until Thursday. A major winter storm hit the northern plains and upper Midwest of the United States with strong winds and heavy snow on Wednesday, forcing hundreds of schools to close, canceling flights, and making road travel difficult, if not impossible, in some areas of the country. Over 50 million Americans were under a winter weather alert on Wednesday morning as the storm moved across a wide swath of the western and northern United States, heading east. The National Weather Service said that up to 60 centimeters of snow and winds of up to 97 kilometers per hour were expected in some locations until Thursday. Blizzard Warnings in the Mountains Over Los Angeles Los Angeles and Ventura County residents living in mountains above the city of Los Angeles were advised to travel only for emergencies Wednesday morning as the area expected wind gusts up to 75 miles per hour to whip in heavy snow and virtually eliminate any visibility. The blizzard and winter storm warnings, in effect until Saturday afternoon morning, said two to seven feet of snow was expected to accumulate by Saturday night, with up to 12 inches at higher elevations. Some areas also expected rains on Thursday and Friday. The Los Angeles NWS said Wednesday was the first time it had ever issued a blizzard warning for the area. Light snow had begun to fall on the Interstate 5 Grapevine Mountain Pass connecting the Los Angeles area to Central California, the Weather Service said. Winter weather and winter storm advisories were also in effect for San Bernardino and Riverside counties further inland from Los Angeles and for parts of San Diego County further south. California drought eased, before and after photos show recovery at drought-stricken California Reservoir. Freeze warning in San Francisco Bay Area. Sub-freezing temperatures as low as 20 degrees were expected in some parts of the Bay Area along with wind gusts up to 50 miles per hour, the NWS said. Freeze warnings were expected to remain in effect until 9 a.m. Thursday. Residents were advised to move vulnerable plants and pets indoors to protect them from the freezing temperatures, and to prevent any outdoor pipes from bursting by draining them. Most of Northern California under severe weather advisories. Eureka, Redding, Chico and other communities in Northern California were all under winter storm, winter weather watches or advisories Wednesday. NWS said all of northwestern California expected hail and light to heavy snow from Tuesday night through Thursday. Power outages across California amid strong winds. Close to 100,000 customers were without power in California Wednesday morning, according to PowerRoutage.us, as parts of the state contended with strong winds. The Pacific Gas and Electric Company said Tuesday night it would mobilize personnel to prepare from outages resulting from poor weather conditions. California Power Outage Tracker, over 110,000 customers without power as strong winds hit. Thank you for watching, and don't forget to stay tuned to our channel as we may return at any moment with new updates. Until the next video.